Man, you man, you sit up there and complain and complain. I don't know why this happened to me. Complain. I don't. I, this should have never happened to me. Complain. I, I don't know what I done to let this happen to me. It shouldn't be. That. I'm too nice. I'm so nice. I'm so nice. I don't do nobody wrong. And I got this stuff to deal with. I should have had things like this to deal with. It shouldn't be happening to me. I'm too good a person for this to be happening to me. God, you treated me wrong. I don't deserve this, God. Why? I thought all the people that could have married this crazy man. Why did I have to marry this? Oh, Jesus, have mercy on me. Listen, 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 listen. You will never access your ability in a pity party. You will never use the ability of God in you if you're continuing to feel sorry for yourself and crying about why you're in a situation. You got to look at that situation and say, it's all right. It's all right. I'm in it and it's all right. I'm in it and I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to murmur because those who murmur, it's my example. They are my example. You cannot do nothing but be destroyed. Complaining won't do nothing but destroy you. Feeling sorry for yourself won't do nothing but destroy you. And if you don't want to be destroyed, stop your complaining. Get your head up and say, thank you, Jesus. I have the ability to deal with whatever that's. Look at it, 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 look at it. He said, neither, verse 9, neither let us tempt Christ as some of them tempted Christ. Neither let us commit fornication. You ain't the only one that had sexual desires. They had them. And look what happened to them. The Bible said they died 23,000 in one day because they committed fornication. These are my examples to show me, to show me that if you go that route, this is what's going to happen to your life. But if you stop and start looking at the fact that you ain't the only single man, you are not the only single woman that got to deny yourself and live a celibate life. You're not the only one that got to be celibate, that had a man, had a woman, whatever you had. I don't know what it was. You're not the only one who had a homosexual relationship, and now God is telling you to go straight. You're not the only one that know, I'm trying to tell the truth up in here, that know about a lesbian relationship, and now you got to be straight. You're not the only one. Stop having a pity party, feeling sorry for yourself, and start looking on the inside, and start saying, for God has given me the ability, the power, the power, and the love to stand up and go straight and stand and be strong. I'm not the only one. This is what the Lord put in my spirit. This is what the Lord put in my spirit. He said, you got to get this in you now before you get under pressure. Fear brings pressure. Fear rushes in. You ever seen fear? Fear rushes in on you. Fear, fear rush in on you. It'll rush in on you. And before you know it, it'll rush in and send you all kind of signals. It'll rush in on you and get into your emotions and make you start feeling things. Where does fear come? Fear comes to your thoughts. How does it get there? It comes by hearing. I was, I was on the plane. Boy, I was doing so good. Man, they, we were sitting on the plane for I don't know how long. Man, we were sitting there just resting. Man, I had to go preaching, and, and I was uh, in this city, and I was sitting there just waiting, man. I went on to sleep. It was hot on that plane. I didn't care nothing about it, man. I just rested away. Woke up, man. All of a sudden, a person was standing over me. and heard them talking, and they began to speak words, and fear started trying to get in my system. And the Lord showed me how it rushes in on you. Something kicked in. Power from within. 
kicked in and said, you won't do it if you try. You don't know what you can do if you try. Man, I, I gathered my mind back together, sat down there and started working on that test and scored extremely high on that test. Listen, listen, listen. Fear told me I didn't have the ability. The power within rose up in me and said, don't you give up, you tried right. Now.